Derek McKenna here for RoyersBoxing.com with Big Tommy McCarthy. Tommy, uh, any news for us at the moment? I know you are. There was plans for you to be out soon, but um, what's the latest on that? Yeah, well, I'm gonna be boxing on the uh, first of August, and um, that's that's the next thing. I was due to box on uh, June the 26th, but uh, it didn't materialize. So there could be an order before him, but August 1st is the exact date that I'm gonna be boxing. That's Nailed on that sense either. And uh, <coughs> obviously, uh, we won't announce the venue on that yet, but it's going to be a big show in Belfast on, on August 4th. Yeah, that's the best going to be a big show. There's going to be a lot of local fairs on it, and um, it's a great show to be a part of. Can you can you let us know which fighters are going to be on there? Or is that still under wraps? Or? It's still under wraps, but you know it's going to be the be the the, the criminal crap here from Belfast and, and uh, all around it, particularly West Belfast, because. West Baba seems to be leading the, the charge of the city, like, but I think it's going to be a lot of the best local fighters are going to be on. And how has your training been going? I know you were you were abroad for a bit. You were over in Denmark, I believe, and yeah. um, like, you know, I presume you're you're still in training at the moment. Take it yeah, you know, I've been training as I said. I was maybe fighting on at the end of June, so I've been training hard. I've been been um, getting good sparring and it was sparring with Frito. Frito was going to be fighting for uh, a Frito Milliard or so. Yeah. It was going to be fighting for an Irish title. And uh, I think that's fell through. It did, I, was, I, think I was it sparring did. with him because he, he, he struggles to get sparred. And me and big Steve, Steve Moore, the amateur boxer, he's he's going away, so I've been sparring him. So I've been training hard, like I'm, I'm good to go, like I'm be ready in the morning if I'm on the boxing. And you've been kept busy over the last while as well. What's the, after August? Is there any um, short term plans for you or long term plans in that regard? Or? You know, we'll get this August show going. It's going to be an eight rounder, and then after that, you know, I'm, we're looking to push on. We're going to be fighting for the for the titles, hopefully. You know what I mean? And you know, it's no secret that it's hard for me to get mates, but. No officers, they, they can't dodge me anymore. Really. Obviously, we're here at the D Day show tonight. What did you make of some of the fights tonight? Some the fights were brilliant. You know, it's it's good to see all the, all the local fouls getting good good um, good competition. The I think Paul Halem was in a brilliant fight. They really earned his victory and. They uh, who tapped the bill, they got a good round. So everybody, everybody was brilliant, and I'm always supporting the, the local lads because I know them. We came through the ranks with them, and they're all there behaving as well. So thanks a lot, Tommy. Uh, we look forward to seeing you on August the fourth. Good stuff. All right, thanks, all right. Good stuff.